Trifle is one of those puddings that never goes out of fashion and this is a delicious festive version made with oranges and ginger cake. Now to begin with, I'm going to segment an orange. Now I've already done four and taken the zest off two of them. So I'm just taking the top and bottom of the orange and then just slice around it, removing the skin and all of the pith. Let's just get rid of all that peel. And then just using a bowl to collect all of that juice because we're going to use it in a moment, cut close to the membrane and then gently flip out the segments. Now you should have about 150 mils of orange juice here and to that I'm going to add five tablespoons of Pedro Jimenez. So if you're doing it in a jug that's about 75 mils. Now this is a lovely, sweet, treacly sherry, but you can use whatever you've got at home as long as it's sweet. Now, I'm just gonna give that a little stir and pop it to the side, along with those orange segments. Now for the cake, I'm using a ready-made ginger loaf cake, and I'm just going to I've cut it into four slices, into long slices, and now I'm gonna trim them to fit into our trifle bowl. Now if you like, you can just cut it into triangles, or if you want to, you can make little houses and then use the trimmings to line the bottom of the bowl. And here's my bowl. I'm just going to position them up against the sides. And then you can just use these trimmings to fill out the bottom of the bowl. Keep those houses in position. So we've got our cake layer in place now. Now for the oranges, I'm just going to spoon them on top of the cake. Just try and get an even layer. And next, I've got some custard here. Now I've got quite a large trifle bowl here, so we're probably not going to fill it up to the top, but it's still going to look very beautiful once it's all in. There we go. And now for the syllabub element of our trifle. I've got some double cream here. I'm going to start whisking it until it just starts to thicken and hold its shape. Now I'm just going to stop there. I'm going to add in the greater zest of two oranges and some caster sugar and then that reserved orange juice and sherry mixture. And we'll whisk this again until it gets a little bit firmer. There. Now I'm happy with that. We don't want it to be too firm. It should be quite soft still. Let's bring this up. I'm just going to drop spoonfuls over the top of the custard. There we are. It smells lovely with that sherry coming through. And to finish it all off, just a sprinkle of toasted pistachio nuts. And then just chill it until you're ready to serve a festive orange and ginger syllabub trifle. And for more of my recipes, don't forget to subscribe to the Waitrose YouTube channel.